Hey guys, Prepper Nurse One here. Um, I wanted to talk to you today about gas masks. Okay, so first of all, grab this one first. And this one here is a child size. Okay, and I have all the filters that go in the side. I can uh, show you that. You would uh, unscrew this here part and then just screw it right into the side, okay? So um, this is a child size, and uh, the reason that when I got these, um, when I got these, here's an adult size, and I'll show you how that works. I will put the thing on. And then you're going to just twist the thing right on here. And it has a good seal. So you can actually tighten them up as well. So it has a real good seal on it. And if you want to tighten them, it has all the things to tighten them up there. Like I said, then you just screw the thing right onto the side. Okay, so um, I have... I have five of them. Um, I when I got the gas mask, the kids were really young, so I got two child and I got three adults. Um, and basically, it was for me, um, Amy, my ex-wife, um, Josh, my stepson, and the twins. So um, obviously now it's just me and the twins. So you know I have two extra for child gas mask. Um, I think it's a really important thing to have, and. Um, you know, if you have an emergency situation and there's a biological threat, you have the gas mask so you can actually breathe decent air so you can get out and do what you got to do. Um, if you have to bug out of your situation, you can be able to do it, you know, and survive. Um, also, uh, if you look back at like Mount St. Helens back in the 80s when the volcano went off and all the ash and stuff that spewed everywhere, if you didn't have a gas mask, you were putting a, a, a bandana or just uh, the smaller thing over your mouth. Well, if you get that ash into your lungs, it's basically fine glass is what uh, ash is, and that will kill you. And I'm sure it's ca caused a lot of respiratory problems with the people, you know, from that time period. Um, but if you had your gas mask, you're going to be okay. Um, also, um, if you were out in a protest, not that I would ever be in a protest. I, you would never see me protest anything, even if I agree with it. Um, and they use tear gas on you, and if you have your gas mask, then you don't care um, because they have their gas mask on. So, um, look, I can remember back when uh, I was in the service, and uh, when you go through basic training, you have your gas mask and stuff like that, and they have a thing where they take you to the gas chamber, and uh, you stand in line, and they wheel you in there 10 at a time with your gas mask on, and then they make you take it off. And it's basically to prove to you that it works. And I can remember, because I was kind of a smart ass, I said to the drill instructor, I said, uh, Sergeant, I said, uh, what if I tell you I believe you that it works? He says, Carswell, you're going in. He goes, actually, you're going to be one of the first ten to go in. And I was. I was one of the first ten to go in because I was a smart ass. So um, you take that gas mask off and tear gas, and I'm going to tell you what. I mean, you know, you had we had the snot running out of our nose. I mean, literally just coming right out your eyes are burning I mean it is brutal and uh, so you know then they get when they get you out of there and um, you walk into the wind and it blows it all off and uh, then we got to watch everybody else go through the gas chamber and when they came out I'm gonna tell you what it's one of the hardest times I've ever laughed in my life because even though we had just done it ourselves to watch the other people come out and they're all staggering, and their arms are all wide. It's like, Ugh! and the, I like, I literally, I mean, you just, you're running. This, your snot is just running out of your nose. It's disgusting, but it's funny when you're watching somebody else do it. Um, so you know, having it for that, or you know, I mean, just having it for an emergency situation. Um, let me know what you guys think, um, how it works for you. If you guys have them, if you don't, um, like I said, I have adult and child sizes, so. Um, you know, if you got little kids around, you know, having an adult-sized gas mask is not going to help them. So uh, let me know what you think. Proper nurse went out for now.